Hey guys, all of, as all of you know that the iPhone OS 4.0 has been released for developers only and you're really dying into trying it on your iPhone or iPod Touch. Well, this tutorial is going to teach you how to get the firmware for free and uh, like it can work with no UDID activation. Like just disconnect your internet while restoring and after it's done and disconnect your iPod, just connect your internet again. So. The website I'm going to tell you about, it's really amazing that every update for the iPhone OS, like Beta 2, if it came, it'll be arriving at the site really quick and available to download. And the really good thing about that website is that you can actually download the iPhone SDK where you develop apps, but I'm not sure if you can get them on your iPod because you have to be a paid developer. So, not paid developer, I mean like registered developer. So the website's called imodzone.net slash download. The link will be in the video description. So this is how the site will look like. So as you can see right here, iPhone OS 4.0. You need to register your device ID with a dev account to use it. Well, I'm not, I'm not going to register and mine is not registered. Uh, so I'm telling you just disconnect your internet while restoring and after it's done, disconnect your iPod from iTunes and just connect back and no problems. So you can see here, um, uh, iPhone OS has a lot of betas here. So you have iPod Touch 3G Beta 1, iPod Touch 2G, iPhone 3GS, iPhone 3G. So you select which one you have. For instance, I'll select the uh, 3G. Then download. You click download. As soon as you click download, it'll start downloading. You can see right there. So when it's, it's done downloading, you can just, you know, like the, put it on your iPhone or iPod Touch. Now, the important point is when you actually want to restore to the iPhone OS 4 is in iTunes, when you want to restore, if you're on Mac, you press Alt and click on Restore. Don't click on Check for Updates. Don't click, I mean, like Alt, Check for Updates. Click Alt, uh, Restore. And if you're on uh, Windows, click Shift, Restore. Don't click Shift, uh, Check for Updates. Because if you click Check for Updates, it will give you errors like while restoring. And it's really, we all don't need that. So that's the website really amazing and sometimes very laggy because a lot of people on it but now it's not laggy because as soon as the firmware came out um people were downloading it so there was a lot of traffic and everyone oh, basic not everyone but a lot of people got it so the site's now faster so now we've talked about the iphone os uh, firmwares downloading so now let's talk about the sdk sdk is xcode 3.2.3 and iphone sdk 4 beta it's a program where you make and like make the, your app for the iPhone, or Apple Touch, or even the iPad. It has an interface builder. It's basically where you put your icons and how the app will look like. And you can click on uh, simulate an iPhone or simulate an iPad. And it will show you how your, iPad, your app will look like on the device. And it, you can click here. These, all the past ones are the old ones. So you may click on the first one, the 4 beta, and click download. And as soon as you click download, you can see it's going to start downloading right here. It is two gigabytes, so you need may need uh, may have to need a speed fast internet connection, so you won't wait a long time. So this site is really wonderful. I love it, and it's called www.imodzone.net slash download slash. I'll put the link in the video description, so you won't have a lot of struggle getting into the site. So yep, that's how you download iPhone OS 4.0 beta for any device. That's the most best way for me or even it may be for you from now on uh, to download the firmware so yep yeah, that's the site i'm talking about that's my tutorial for today please rate comment subscribe please subscribe for more videos rate five stars or uh, wait no rate five stars the new layout to youtube layout so make the like button thumbs up button it really helps a lot thank you for watching please thumbs up button subscribe and comment if you have any questions i'll definitely be available to answer you